David Lockle at the Akron Police Department. I've been with Akron for 13 years. Since Akron is a college party town, we deal with a lot of younger people. With that comes a lot of drug and alcohol offenses we have to deal with. Oh, beautiful. I get a call of a female who's outside urinating and she keeps falling down, banging on doors. So she's uh, apparently celebrating the first blizzard in Akron. Oh, here she is, right in the middle of the road. Unbelievable. Snowiest day of the year, walking right down the middle of the road. A belt covered in snow. Priceless. Come here. <laughs> Do you have any idea where you're at? I'm on my own. Wow. <laughs> Was that English? <laughs> wow. <laughs> Do you realize you are right smack in the middle of Waterloo yeah, Road? Yeah. Why don't you step over here so that these cars can get around you, okay, dear? Uh, Do you have an ID on you by any chance? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You, yeah. You, you're going to have to start formulating some English words here to help me out because I really have no idea what you got going on. What's your name? Vonda. I tell you, how about if you lean up against the car because I think you're probably going to fall down again. Here, come up over here. You going to fall? All right. Do you know where you any idea where you're at, what time it is, anything? So well, you are a friendly girl, aren't you? Yeah, pretty. Ass. You are, you are friendly. <laughs> I bet you're a lot of fun. I love y'all. Well, good. I'd consider that a compliment if you weren't so intoxicated. What's your date of birth, dear? Five twenty-three sixty-six. And you have a phone number? Five twenty-three sixty-six. Yeah, that's your, that's your date of birth. How about your phone number? Here, instead of winking at me, how about giving me, giving me some information, all right? Let's say I want to call you tomorrow. What's your phone number? Now, focus. Phone number. 523-66. Okay. She's probably one of the drunkest people I've come across. You, you're pretty. Well, thank you. I appreciate that. You're so pretty. Well, thank you. Thank you. The level of intoxication for drunk for operating a vehicle is 0 .08. I bet she's very well could be over three. Um, and at that point, she might even have to go to the hospital instead of the detox. Have you ever been up to detox before? Never. When we get up there, I want to find out how drunk you are. I ain't drunk. Oh, you are good and drunk. I ain't drunk. Oh, yeah. You want to have a seat in my car for a minute? All right, don't, don't fall. Okay, here's here's the rules when you get in. Oh, eat, eat. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right, okay, hold on, hold on. Don't, hold on, don't fall, don't touch anything, and don't don't puke. If you throw up in my car all that flirting you did earlier, is not going to do you any good. Dunk a do ball. <laughs>